Hey, ready fish. 20th of November, 2017. And I'm looking around to see what Obama's up to, and I came across this. For November 29th, Pete Sousa, he's President Obama's chief official White House photographer. In other words, he was in Obama's pocket 24-7. Always with the president. That's very important. Because... I made a couple of connections here that I want to throw out there just for consideration once again. This Mr. Sousa is going to be giving this show at the Getty Center in Los Angeles. Now you know how I love my maps, but first of all, this is the Getty Center right here, and this is the view it has of Los Angeles. Okay? Sits right down here, right next to Bel Air. This is the Getty Center right here, and it sports a beautiful view of the entirety of the Los Angeles area. And I'm looking around on this guy, and lo and behold, his name is Sousa. And I remember some months ago, there was some issues with the old Vatican that, uh, with their Jesuit general um, ranks, I guess you could say, right? So they went through a change of their Jesuit general. And they wound up with this guy. His name is Arturo Sosa. Okay? And Pete Sousa is the photographer for Obama, who will be appearing at the Getty Center. There is a wiki on Mr. Sosa, Obama's photographer, that is so plain Jane it it screams to me that it was fabricated and I could be totally wrong but that's what I'm seeing and I believe that this Mr. Sosa and Mr. Sousa aren't necessarily related but I believe that Mr. Sosa Mr. Obama's photographer was a Jesuit operative because let's face it folks the Jesuits are the strong arm and the sneaky arm and the underhanded arm that has infiltrated everything. Everything. And we cannot deny that Trump, I'm sorry folks, but Trump, remember how we met with the Pope? May 24th, gave him a lotus flower and books on Martin Luther King Jr. I think there's a double message in that gift, if you know what I mean. But they were all dressed in black. Why? Well, that's how you greet the black pope. That's how you respect the godfather. You know what I'm saying? And Trump was Jesuit trained, 100%. This is where he got his start, folks. Fordham. 100% Jesuit. Okay? All dressed in black. Perfectly placed with the effeminate Jesus in the Vesica Pisces, the Matrix. All of it. It's right there. And this guy is appearing on the 29th at the Getty Center, which the 29th, I'm sorry, I have uh, just feelings about that. There's too much tied to it. And he is the, quote, photographer. Do you understand where I'm coming from? And he's going to be right here on the 29th for all to see and for photograph and archive the destruction. This is just what came into my head, and I'm letting it out. Because if I don't, and I sit on it, it will drive me crazy. And I pray that nothing happens here. I do. I pray that this isn't the case. But the things I've been shown, and the things I've come to understand about how this world works, dead sheep and serpents in the ocean, this is, this is the beast in the system. Google Earth, don't be evil. You understand where I'm coming from? So, basically all I'm saying is, you know, consider what I'm telling you. But the main thing is, is to understand that you are living in a dark world, and if you don't know Christ, you're going to continue in darkness. You know, he is the light. He is the truth. He is the way. And I just will continue saying that because it's true. That's all there is to it. So I wanted to point that out to you guys. That's all. November 29th, President Obama's photographer 
will be sitting high atop the hills of Los Angeles in the Getty Center. Let's not forget now, the Gettys. You want to get into some uh, wild, weird, satanic, funky stuff, look into the whole Getty gig. Perfect view. That just, it's unsettling with me. That's all I can tell you. Pray up. Keep looking up. Have a good week. Peace and grace to y'all. Many fish. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore take unto you the whole armor of God, 